have one eye that's finished and one eye that's not. Um, cause I thought I'd talk about like just what I do with my eye just to get out the door in the morning <laughs> or afternoon whenever it might happen. Um, I don't usually wear a lot of eyeshadow or anything, but I really like to line my eye before leaving the house with eyeliner and with mascara. Mascara is like a definite must. So I really started liking the Makeup Forever um, liquid eyeliner, the blue one that I've showed you before. But today I'm trying a different one with you. Um, one that um, I found on Amazon. It's called Line and Grow. Cause like I'm obsessed with trying to get my um, eyelashes not to fall out. <laughs> there are so many things you have to worry about when you get older. And one of them is thinning eyelashes, unfortunately. And you know, they fall out and they thin and stuff. So I'm sort of obsessed with trying to find products that um, that keep them from falling out and stuff. And at night I use, I have been using the Smashbox Lash Revival. Um, it's a, it's a, a treatment for your actual lashes. So you use like a mascara brush and there's like a liner thing that you put like where your eyeliner would go. Um, so I've been using that. I think it works. Um, but so I found this on Amazon called Lash and Grow and it's a tinted lash enhancer is what they call it. And um, so it were supposed to work like a liquid eyeliner and then like um, give your lashes nourishment like along the, along the edge of your lashes. And I'm gonna zoom in. So I've already put it on this eye, the eyeliner there. And it's a really pretty color. Can you see it there? It's a really pretty color um, and I really like it, but I have to say, I I'm gonna show you how I put it, put it on, but I have to say that compared to the Makeup Forever, it doesn't last and I don't like the color as much and it's not as precise the way you put it on. So um, I use it like for every day for leaving the house because um, if I really want my makeup to last and look nice, I definitely want to use the Makeup Forever one because this one's just not as, not as good. So I put it on up here. Now I'm trying not to put my hand in front of my eye, which means that it's looking kind of awkward for you guys, I think. But see, it's it's not very, um, I, I, the way I want to describe it is like it's a watercolor. It doesn't go on very colorful to start. You can definitely see it's like a tinted something else because um, it doesn't give that much color when you first put it on and you have to like do a couple of layers to get it to actually make a color and stay. So I guess there must be some sort of oil in the product or something because, see, so that's, that's that eye line like the other one now. Not very prettily because I'm trying not to get my hand in the way of my eye, but there you go. Okay, so that's that. Now I've talked to you guys about before about my droopy eyelid. I have to sort of keep like this until it's dry. Otherwise, um, if I like just go like this and look down, then there'll be a line of that color up here if it's not dry enough. Okay, and then um, I talked to you about the mascara I'm gonna use before. It's the um, All May um, Intense Eye Color um, Brown Topaz or Topaz Brown. Brown Topaz, which I really like. It's supposed to be good for my eye color and it's great for every day because it's brown, it's not black, and so it's not as dramatic. And I really like it, but so I also got some other things in that color range and I'm going to do something with that later in the week. But one of the things that I'm really loving is um, the brown eye color for blue eyes, um, eye pencil, and it, um, it's brown topaz it's called too. And um, it it's a pencil like this, so it's um, it, it comes out like this like a lead pencil, mechanical pencil sort of thing. And I really like using this on my lower eyeliner 
lid. I don't like to be too heavy on my lower lashes because it, it will drag my eyes down. Um, so just a little bit, but I do need a little bit of definition. So now you see it's starting to look a little bit more like my other eye. And then I have the mascara. And after I put that on, I'll be ready to face the world. I am wearing again the, the HD um, Makeup Forever foundation, the HD formula foundation. Um, now I've been told I have to get really close and hold still so you can see my lashes and see how it looks. Okay, so I really like it. It's good. Um, I feel like it defines my lashes without being too overly dramatic for every day. And I'm ready for everyday use. Um, yeah, hope you had fun. I did. Bye.